Hello everyone, welcome to Explore Hop. So for this example, we're told that in a small town during winter, the probability of snow is 45%. When it snows, the probability of a randomly selected house experiencing a power outage is 30%. If the house has a power outage when it snows, then there is an 80% chance that there will be a school closure. What is the probability of snow where the house has a power outage and there is a school closure. First, let's start by defining the following events. So we'll let event A be the event that there is snow. So A is equal to the event where there is snow. Next, we'll let event B be the event where a randomly selected house has a power outage. So B is going to be equal to the event where house has a power outage. And finally, we'll let event C be the event where there is a school closure. So C is equal to the event where there is a school closure. Now let's write down the givens. We know that the probability that there will be snow is 45%. So the probability of event A is equal to 0 0.45, which is 45%. We're then told that the probability of a randomly selected house experiencing a power outage is 30% when it snows. So that's the conditional probability of B given A. So the probability of B given A is equal to 30%, so 0 0.3. And finally, we're told that if the house has a power outage when it snows, then there is an 80% chance that there will be a school closure. So that's the conditional probability of C given A and B. So the probability of C given A and B is equal to 0 0.8, which is 80%. Now to find the probability of snow where the house has a power outage and there is a school closure, we can find the probability of the intersection of all three events. And to do this, we can use the following formula. So the probability of the intersection of event A and B and C is equal to the probability of event A times the conditional probability of B given A times the probability of C given A and B. And this is just equal to 0 0.45 times 0 0.30 times 0 0.80, which is equal to 0 0.108. And that gives us the probability of the intersection of all three events, which is the probability of there being snow, where the house has a power outage, and there is a school closure. And that's it for this example. Thank you for joining us. See you in the next lesson.